Okay, there. I've started to build some more people. As you can see, my manpower's gone down. Um, I'll leave it like that for now, just because we need some more later. But I'm trying to, you know, because I remember while I was playing with Austria, I finally declared war. <laughs> I decided to just go all out against Pers um, Prussia, but then Ottomans came up behind me and declared war as well. Really annoying, but then I just decided to, you know, stop it for then and start my own one. My full one, which is going to be Great Britain, for my first game. So, and I decided that, you know, we need to have people being made while you're at war, because what happens is, you know, you start losing men, and it takes so long from the rebuilding. The building time takes bloody ages. The speed of forces are really slow on this. Um, so that's one of the pain things. It's a real sort of like, this one's a real nail biter. Pain in the ass to get your forces about. You really need to plan exactly what's going to happen. Uh, your ports are blocked. Okay. Where is this happening? So, okay, they've got a France troop there. Get them to join. Okay, there we go. Channel Fleet 24. <clears throat> Should I attack them? Most of that is transport. Transports 9, 1, 2, 12 transports. So, is that just transport? I can't really see. This is getting annoying. I need to close in a bit more. There we go. I like that looks so much cooler actually. Okay. So apparently they're all Okay, is there more ships? This is they're all transport ships. Okay, so there's twelve transport ships. That they should be able to handle this. I'm assuming. Ships of the line seven no that's mine. Yeah, they're all transport, so I should be able to handle that. But why are they just sat there? Can I not declare, can I not fight them? I'm not really sure how it works. <laughs> okay, apparently I don't, can't fight them, I'm not really sure how it works. Damn it, I really should have learnt more about the game. Like I say, Austria didn't really have a seafare and stuff. Which I should have realised was going to be important for Great Britain. That's not trying to avoid battles. Detach supply, okay. This need to get more of my men together so I can send them off. We've got 66,000 there, actually, that's... Should be the right amount. 65. Okay, they just got a bit too much. Might have to take someone out. Oh, wait, no. Okay, go in there, that's it. Oh. Okay, I'm confused. What what just happened? Did I send them in? Ah, what's going on? This is annoying me. Okay, there we go. I can load them onto the ship. Okay, it did work. Okay. So I can send about 65,000 men across. They have about 400,000 army. Obviously, they're not all going to be in the same place. But still. I'll wait until I've got all my men down here so I can then quickly get them to and fro. Don't want to send them off and then leave them there. Definitely not. Okay. For now, I'll be defensive until I know my allies have got there. Let's see if my I can see what my allies are doing. Yeah, that's good. Once I form a coalition with them, I can see what they're doing. Okay. It looks like Russia are going all out against Persia. Persia shouldn't really stand a chance against them. So I should be fine on that regards. Oh, Battle of Linguini, 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 see? Didn't even realise that was going on. Okay, Sicily. Oh, okay, we got a Russian boats, Russian fleet. Okay, interesting. Oh, shit, I didn't even see this. Okay, that was what the battle was. Okay. Why is my fleet there? Okay, my Mediterranean, I didn't even see my Mediterranean fleet. Okay, I should really look to make sure I've... Okay, I've got Gibraltar as well. I completely forgot. Okay. This... See, we're in such a bad position, Grib. We've got places all over the place. Well, we haven't, but we've got stuff in Gibraltar. Great fortress. It should be able to stand for quite a while, I think. But I don't like that we're here. We should probably go and help Gibraltar. Gibraltar. 
Gibraltar force. Wow, that is 11,000 men. Hopefully we can hold it. Okay, let's go in a bit. So we've got their sea ships there. Okay, we should take out those ships of ours. Um, we got some men in Gibraltar. They haven't really sent many men to Spain, but they will take that at some point. I not kidding you. They will definitely get at some point. Because if I send all my men down there to help Gibraltar, France is going to invade us. Ah, oh, this is such an annoying position. I really need to get pressure involved. Oh. We are now about independence guaranteed by Russia. Well, okay, thank you, Russia. <laughs> okay. Not sure what that's about. Surprised they did that. Usually don't really do it against other... Oh, shit. Okay. We need to get help our allies. Wait, are these all... Some of them must be ships of the line. Transport's 13, so 10. Yeah, we should be able to help. 10 added ships, make 20. Our ships are beating them anyway, but that added bonus. And there we go, victory again. We're defeating the French ships. Okay, as I weaken their navy as well, that's good, because that means they're easier to get across. Under attack in Gibraltar. Okay. Ah, they've got military access to France. Okay, how many men? Okay, sort of even. We've got the morale boost. You might be able to just win. No, they're starting to push us back. Okay, they're really starting to kick her out. Okay, we lost. Okay, that's not good. Gibraltar is now under siege. The Ottomans have decided to request help from Persia in exchange for war subsidies. Wow, that's interesting. Okay, Gibraltar is under attack. I can't really help Gibraltar. That's what's really annoying. It's a really good base, but I can't see how I can help them at this second in time. Have they got any transport? No. I was wondering if they had any men on them. This is such a frustrating one. Okay, 67. That's another fleet. So we've got two forces being sent over. That's 120. 45 plus 13. I can send about 365s over, so that's like... Uh, 65, 130, 195,000 men. That's still not enough. They will absolutely... Just, you know, if they've got all their men there still, which they probably do, because Russia hasn't been able to go over yet. They will defeat us. Uh, Sissy's not doing anything, but that's not a big problem. I probably need to try and get some more people into our allies. Battle of Gibraltar, good. Okay, they tried to attack us. Tried to assault the base. Okay, I need to get someone else into our coalition. I might just bring Sweden in. Just because... Actually, wait, the end of the month's almost here. Hopefully, I'll deplete pressures. Okay. Another battle. One and see. Ooh, battle Gibraltar. That was going to come. Our, our team there were so small. Didn't really stand much of a chance. Okay, the new month. There we go. Just in time for the defeat of Gibraltar. Lovely. It's under attack again. God damn it. Okay, so they're helping Persia. A lot of people trying, wanting to help Persia. How is their relationship with? Three must be zero. Like, oh, come on, it's so close. I Maybe mean, I should do Austria as well, because I've got a lot of you know prestige. It's not a big deal for me at the moment. Yeah. Sabotage relations. Yeah, we go. Yeah, I, I might as well. I need as much help as I can get. One of them will get down at some point. Should I try and get? I'm thinking of getting the help of one of these states, but. They'll just be crushed by France, and then they'll be taken over by France. I don't want to give France an option. That's, that's Sweden. We'll get Sweden to join us. Oh, Sweden refused to join our coalition. Ah, this is not good. I need way more men way way more men 
We get transport, ship of the line five. Let's destroy that fleet. How come I can't attack this fleet? Okay, I guess it's, I think it's, oh, I think it's docked, that's why. I don't know why I clicked on that fleet. They out there had stopped them from leaving, I guess. The 24, go back. Okay. One from back from Sweden. Sweden declared war upon the enemy Denmark. Okay. Sweden have their own interests, I guess. Obviously want to take over Denmark for their own personal gain. During all turmoil, because no one's really going to stop him. Apart from maybe Prussia, who might want to get involved as well. Okay. I, I'm just waiting for my men to be made. Sorry, guys. There's not really much going on. I'm just trying for my men to be made so I can then attack mainland France. Hopefully they won't be expecting it. I, I don't know. <laughs> so then I can just like duck off and then try and fight as much as I can. Because this is going to be pointless. Whoever docks the other first. Okay, that sounds bad. If you know what docking is, that sounds terrible. Um, that is, okay, I'm not going to go into that. But yeah, if they land on England first, then that's going to be pain for me because I'm going to try and get rid of them. They can move about, taking places. If I can get into France first, I can start ravaging the lands, taking forts. Try and, uh, what I'm going to try and do is try and not get battle with them unless I know I'm going to win. If, I, if I'm not sure, I'm not going to take battle with them. It's not worth it. Denmark honor their military talents of Spain. They're not war great, but damn you, Denmark! Damn you, Sweden! Join me, please. Please, Sweden. Come on, you're at war with Denmark. They're my enemy. We should. My enemy's enemy is my friend. Have you never heard that? God. I mean, they weren't enemies with us before. Yes, there we go. Awesome. Okay, hopefully they'll be able to beat back Denmark. Um. Come on, Prussia. God damn it, free. Let's look at Austria. Austria doesn't seem to be doing much at all, to be honest. Um, guaranteeing the independence of Bavaria and Baden. Okay, that's what they seem to be doing. It's six. Okay, their one's better. Actually, maybe if I can try and make a relationship good with Spain. Because they don't seem to like France either. Spain's member... I was wondering if I could sabotage the relationship, maybe they would leave Spain's coalition. Is that, I wonder if that's how it works. Just trying to think. Because I've got a lot of bloody members. Tuscany, Spain, the papacy. He's got the Pope on his side. Oh no, what will I do? What will Great Britain do? Napoleon shall pay. Uh, I really need one of those two nations to come help me. Once one of them two can join us, we'll be set. Okay, okay, that's interesting. We've been guaranteed by Sweden as well. Thank you, Sweden. What is it with these nations assuming they can guarantee me? At the moment, we sort the sea dominance. We're starting to make some people. And that's good. It's just what I need right now. If you join up with these ones, that'll probably make about 65,000. Now I need to think about where I want to attack. Um, where do I want to attack? I won't. I would say this actually got Netherlands as well, but that gives them an extra two forces. So I'm going to try and go for here. I think we'll attack the Havre and ruin. And there's Paris. Okay, yeah, we'll attack this area. Um, try and cause chaos around here, sort of you know um, Normandy sort of area. We'll then head to Paris. Try and take down Paris. That is my plan. 